Hello and welcome to a new video. I'm Vanguard and today, we'll be going through the top 15 biggest upcoming video games confirmed for 2018 to 2019. These are some of the most anticipated titles to come and certainly hold a lot of promise. But without further ado, let's get right into it. First up, we have Resident Evil 2. This is an upcoming remake of the original PlayStation Survival Horror video game from 1998, a heavily praised game for its iconic setting, horror atmosphere and audio work, and was among the best games of that generation. After its surprise remake big reveal at E3 of 2018 this year, it's gotten many people excited to relive this legendary experience. Set to release for the PlayStation 4, Xbox One and Windows PC in January 2019, Next up we have Fallout 76, an upcoming online multiplayer action role-playing video game of the massively popular Fallout series. It is developed by Bethesda Game Studios and published by Bethesda Softworks. This will be the ninth entry in the series, taking place in year 2102, 25 years after the nuclear war devastated Earth. You will be able to play individually or with a party of up to three more, featuring an open world that is apparently four times larger than that of Fallout 4. It is set to release for the PS4, Xbox One and Windows PC on November 14, 2018. Best and brightest. But more importantly, you'll always be my family. Goodbye! Aloha! Ciao! Arrivederci! Au revoir! Auf As you venture out into this new American frontier, some of your fellow survivors may not be neighborly. Metro Exodus is an upcoming first-person shooter video game developed by Ukrainian Studios for a Games and published by Deep Silver. It will be the third installment in Metro, based on a novel series taking place after Last Light in 2033. It will be set in a post-apocalyptic wasteland where players must cope with the new hazards and engage in combat against mutated creatures as well as hostile humans, all in order to find new life. Exodus takes place over the course of one year and begins with a harsh nuclear winter. Scheduled to be released on Microsoft Windows, PlayStation 4 and Xbox One in the third quarter of 2018. Why do you keep going up there? What are you hoping to find? Each time you go out there, I wonder if you'll ever return. Days Gone is an open world post-apocalyptic action survival video game played in a third person perspective. The game takes place two years after a global pandemic occurred, which killed almost all of humanity and transformed millions of others into freakers, who are mindless zombie-like creatures. There will be elements of stealth, third-person shooting and exploration featured in the game. It has been developed by Ben Studio and published by Sony Interactive Entertainment for the PS4. Sekiro Shadows Die Twice is an upcoming action-adventure video game developed by From Software and published by Activision. The game follows a shinobi named Sekiro as he attempts to take revenge on a samurai who attacked him and kidnapped his lord. Its setting is inspired by the late 16th century Sengoku period of Japan. Although compared to From Software's Soul series, the game features no role-playing game elements such as character creation, classes and equipment upgrades. This is certainly a promising new and fresh looking experience, releasing for Windows, PS4 and Xbox One in early 2019. Devil May Cry 5 is an upcoming action-adventure hack-and-slash video game developed and published by Capcom. It will be the sixth installment in the Devil May Cry series, and the sequel to number 4 and the first game since the reboot that was released in 2013. The gameplay will feature the return of Dante and Nero as playable characters, along with a currently unknown third character. It will be a similar experience to the other titles in the franchise, focusing on its fast-paced stylish action that we've all come to know the series for. This was a major and pleasant surprise of E3, set to release in 2019. Forza Horizon 4 is an upcoming open-world racing video game developed by Playground Games and published by Microsoft Studios. It will be the 11th installment in the overall series. The game will be set in a fictionalized representation of the United Kingdom. It will feature over 450 cars, with each server holding up to 72 players online. Forza Horizon 4 was announced at Microsoft's E3 of this year, and is scheduled to be released for the Xbox One and Windows PC on October 2018. Assassin's Creed Odyssey is an upcoming action role-playing video game developed and published by Ubisoft. 
It is the 12th game and the 11th major installment in the Assassin's Creed series, the successor to 2017's Origin. Odyssey is said to place greater emphasis on the role-playing elements compared to the previous entries, and will contain dialogue options, branching quests, and multiple endings. Set to be released for the PS4, Xbox One, and Windows on October 2018. Next up we have Kingdom Hearts 3. This is an upcoming RPG video game developed by Square Enix and is the 12th installment in the entire series and the final chapter in the Dark Seeker saga. This game as always features a wide cast of different Disney characters and worlds, where you play as Sora with a keyblade to fight against the dark forces of Xehanort. It was announced way back in 2013 and since then, fans have been dying for this game. It is scheduled to be released for the PlayStation 4 and Xbox One in 2019 January. Anthem is an upcoming sci-fi multiplayer action role-playing video game developed by Bioware and published by EA. Players will assume the role of a freelancer, a group of people who lead their civilization to explore the surrounding landscape of the dystopian world and protect humanity. You'll be able to play with three other players in the shared open world. Initially, it was announced for a 2018 release, but has since been delayed into early 2019 in February for the PS4, Xbox One, and Windows PC. Right. Checking out the scar camp some more. Look at all the weapons! Oh, and the, and the turrets! Better move quickly. Shadow of the Tomb Raider is an upcoming action-adventure video game developed by Eidos Montreal in conjunction with Crystal Dynamics and published by Square Enix. It will be the third entry to the successful reboot series, following 2015's Rise of the Tomb Raider. Just from what we've seen from the trailers, screenshots, and artwork, it looks to be a splendid title. This game is set to be released on the 14th of September 2018 for Microsoft Windows, PlayStation 4, and Xbox One. Okay, how the hell do we attach these together? The team still has eyes on Jonah Maeda. Biomutant is an upcoming action role-playing video game set in an open world, developed by Experiment 101 and published by THQ Nordic. It is scheduled to be released for Microsoft Windows, PlayStation 4, and Xbox One in 2018. You play as a customizable raccoon-like creature in a world filled with mutated animals. The game will have a branching storyline where decisions made by the players will determine how the narrative will flow. The goal of the story is to save the Tree of Life after the world is struck by a natural disaster. Super Smash Bros Ultimate is an upcoming game for the Nintendo Switch, probably the biggest title to come for the console and has gotten millions of people very excited. This will be a part of the Super Smash Bros series of different crossovers published by Nintendo that primarily features characters from franchises established on its system. The game as always has been about bringing iconic characters from all different genres together, reimagined into a fighting game. Really excited to see more of the new roster after the confirmation of all the characters we've seen so far. Second last on this list is Spider-Man, an upcoming action-adventure video game based on the popular Marvel comic superhero, developed by Insomniac Games and published by Sony Interactive Entertainment for the PS4. The game will tell a new story about Spider-Man that's not tied to the existing comic books, video games, or film. It will cover both the normal life of Peter Parker and the hero Spider-Man, featuring an older, more experienced character than what we're generally used to. 
As someone who's played Spider-Man 2 way back in the PS2 era, the element I'm most excited about is the open world traversal as Spider-Man. I really hope they can nail this aspect specifically, along with the combat to create a truly fun and authentic experience. The game is scheduled to release worldwide on September 7, 2018. Can you hold on a minute? I was in the middle of a phone call and it was business. Charge him! Don't let up! Lost you for a second there. You okay? Not really. Electro, Rhino, and now Scorpion are all on the loose. What's going on in the rest? Finally, we have Red Dead Redemption 2, probably one of the most anticipated games as of right now, the sequel to the 2010 game. It will be an open world action adventure video game played from a third person perspective, featuring single player and online multiplayer components. The first game was met with huge success and was critically acclaimed by reviewers, with great praise directed at the game's visuals, dynamically generated music, voice acting, gameplay and story. This sequel, being developed by Rockstar once again, will hopefully bring another excellent experience, set to be released for the PS4 and Xbox One in 2018. Well, that about wraps up this video. If you enjoyed, please leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know what your thoughts are down below. Thank you all for watching, and until next time, I'll see you later.